Flowers of the Alps by Appa Apps. This game teaches you about the beautiful flowers to be found in the Alps of Europe and includes 172 different species with over 1,000 facts. Tap to continue. Rishan Poppy. You have to pick the right photo. Rishan Poppy. I think it's this one. Rishan Poppy. And swipe to hear the name again. Rishan Poppy. And tap to continue. Mountain Clover. Mountain Clover. Hmm, not sure. Let's try this. No, that's a garland flower. Ah, that's a garland flower. Mountain Clover. Mountain Clover. I think it's this. Mountain Clover. Garland flower. So this is the Mountain Clover and this is Garland flower. Alpine yes, it is. And if you swipe, you can hear the name again. Alpine now, if I draw a bracket, then I'm taken to the facts about Alpine toad flax. We can see the English name, the Latin name, where it grows, and how high. All of which is very helpful. Tap to continue. Now, if I draw a question mark on the screen, then it takes me into help mode. And if I scroll down, I can see lots of other gestures which I can make on the screen, which help to control playing the game. And moving on down towards the bottom of the page, there are many other apps made by Appa Apps. It's really a very wide selection, something for everyone. Tap to continue. If I draw an S on the screen, then I start race mode. And now I have to race through the photos as fast as I can. Large pink. And try not to make a mistake. You have to concentrate quite hard. Missing. It's good fun though. Giant cats here. And a great way to see how much you've learned. Creeping Avon. Creeping Avons. Stemless carline thistle. Stemless carline thistle. May lily. May lily. Hmm. Not sure. No. That's ah. it. Okay, well I made a mistake, so the race is now over, um, but I can go to my results and see how well I did. And I can try and beat my last best time in another race. Now if I want to see those race results again, then I just draw an S backwards. And there we are, back to the race results. Tap to continue. Now there's a feature called slideshow mode. You press the screen with your finger and hold it down for two seconds and a bubble appears. Now this bubble allows you to scroll through all the facts and photographs very simply and quickly. And if you move the bubble vertically, it takes you through the flowers alphabetically. If you move the bubble horizontally, then it takes you through all the flowers of that particular letter. So here we are, we're going through the F's at the moment. Another feature of slideshow mode is that if you rotate your finger inside the bubble, then all the facts for that particular flower will be shown at the bottom of the screen. So it's a very quick way to get information on each flower. Tap to continue. Fragrant orchid. If you want to play the game without any voice prompts, then draw this symbol and it reduces the volume by 50%. Draw it again and it cuts the voice prompts out completely. And then you can play the game in complete silence. If you want at any time to get the voice back, then you simply draw that symbol in reverse. And you can exit the game at any time by drawing a square and then you can return to play Flowers of the Alps another time.